A major controversy has been brewing in Jammu and Kashmir over a school in Srinagar issuing a diktat to one of its teachers telling her to choose between her job and wearing an abaya, a cloak worn by Muslim women. The teacher decided to resign leading to protests by students and political parties. The state government says the school's action is unacceptable. Jammu and Kashmir is not France. The school now says it is sorry. DPS has crossed its limits. They should not have done so. They must apologize and the government must take strict action. Amid controversy and condemnation that erupted over DPS principal's anti abaya stance, the school management has released a statement of apology. The statement says, management apologizes for unintentionally hurting the sentiments of people. But the management doesn't say if they will continue to ban abaya or allow it. The teacher who quit the school over not being allowed to wear abaya has refused to comment. Meanwhile, a source in the school management says she was about to complete her job contract in five days. The PDP BJP government is taking this issue seriously. The education minister from PDP said India was a multi religious society and was not like France, where turbans and headscarves are banned. किसी की धार्मिक भावनाओं को ठेस पहुंचाने वाला कोई भी कार्य जो है वो यहाँ नहीं होना चाहिए ये कोई फ्रांस जैसे रूल हिंदुस्तान के अंदर नहीं बना सकते जम्मू कश्मीर भारत का एक अभिन्न अंग है अटूट अंग है अकॉर्डिंग टू डीपीएस मैनेजमेंट मोस्ट ऑफ द स्टूडेंट्स हु हैड बॉयकॉटेड क्लासेस सिंस फ्राइडे हैव बिगन टू कम बैक वाइल द डीपीएस मैनेजमेंट हैज अपोलॉजाइज फॉर हर्टिंग द सेंटिमेंट ऑफ पीपल द डैमेज इज ऑलरेडी डन as the female teacher resigned after she was allegedly forced not to wear a dress of her choice political groups have strongly reacted and criticized the school but in this whole controversy it is the education that has become a casualty in srinagar nazir masudi for ndtv